Hello, in this video I'm going to show you how you can fix the keyboard glitch that blocks screen on iOS 26. Okay, so uh, when you are in the app in which you have that problem that the keyboard blocks your glitch, uh, for now, for example, I will launch the uh, messages, um, you can simply uh, try the uh, force quit uh, of the app in which uh, that happened. So to force quit an app, um, simply hold on the down side of the screen, open up the recent apps, and now simply swipe away the app. That might help. Also, now you can simply reopen it and check um, is it uh, working properly right now. In some cases, if you are in the app and the keyboard blocks your screen, just like that, you can simply rotate your screen to get into this orientation, then go back and try uh, is your screen responsive right now. That also might help. Mm. If it doesn't, uh, we can restart our iPhone. To do it, mm, we need to click the power button, uh, I mean click volume up, volume down, and then start holding the uh, power button until the Apple logo appears. Then you can release mm, the finger from the power button uh, and wait until the iPhone restarts. Don't worry, it doesn't uh, delete any of your data, so uh, you can be mm, calm about this. Nothing will happen. Uh, we can also open up the settings of our keyboard. We can scroll down into the general, scroll down, find the keyboard, and now click on the keyboards. If you have uh, a lot of them, for example, uh, some third-party keyboards, mm, you can simply uh, remove them or uh, disable them uh, because they are. Uh, that might be the cause uh, of that uh, problem. You can do it right in here. Of course, uh, when it starts uh, to work, I mean, uh, the keyboard, you can uh, again try to add your uh, third-party keyboards and uh, it should be fine. Uh, also, we can reset the whole uh, keyboard settings to do it. Uh, go back. Uh, we need. We still need to be in the general. Mm, now find transfer or reset iPhone. Now click on the reset, and we can reset keyboard dictionary. Simply click on that button mm, and wait until the process is done. Also, it doesn't uh, delete any of your data, so you don't need to worry about it. You can do it right in here. Uh, when we go back again into the keyboard, mm, we can make sure that uh, order correction is off. Same thing with the predictive text and also the smart punctuation. Those things might be uh, triggering uh, that uh, UI glitches. Uh, so we can uh, turn them off and then try mm, mm, then try using the keyboard it might uh, simply start working properly right now all right and that's all in this video thank you all for watching if you found this video helpful please leave a like comment and subscribe